Hey everybody, it's Terry Yoder here with the daily reading for Monday, May 17th, 2021. Today's first card of our three card spread is the Eight of Cups. The Eight of Cups is the card of exit and departure. It's an eight, so it represents the completion of a cycle, the completion of a process, and the beginning of a new. We also see that we have an eclipse noted on the card as well. And eclipses represent changes, ending of one cycle and the beginning of another. The Eight of Cups can represent an emotional exit and departure. Something has happened that has made us so emotional or so angry or so feeling that we just can't contain it and we have to move on. We have to move elsewhere. I decided to cover that card for more information, and what I drew was astonishing, the Ace of Wands. This is by far the highest card of green light and go of the entire deck. It urges us not only to move forward and make the change, to go ahead and do the exit and departure, but adds the additional advice that when we do so, we should release everything that we've been holding on to. What is it that's upsetting you? What is it that is angering you? What are you afraid of? What is it that's causing resistance? Let it go. Let it go, release it, and move cleanly, freely into the new. If we can employ that, what's waiting for us in the environmental aspects is the star. Wishes and dreams come true. That's symbolized by the aspect that she's taking the two pots and pouring them out onto the earth. That which has been desired is manifest onto the earth, manifest into the physical. And our final card for the day, Monday, May 17th, our final outcome is the world. Anything, everything one could hope for, wish for, dream of, or desire with ease, and living in a vibration of victory. I honestly believe that this has some correlation, and the last two readings may have had some correlation, to the event that has happened astrologically as of Thursday last week. Jupiter moved into Pisces. And it's just interesting that Jupiter moved into Pisces in the sign of Taurus. And Jupiter will remain in Pisces until it goes retrograde and backs up and moves into the sign of Aquarius on July 28th, which is in the sign of Leo. It's interesting how the cards correspond with astrological events as well. The move of Jupiter into Pisces is a beautiful thing. It'll bring greatness, joy, movement, flow of emotions, a very, very strong, positive spiritual blessing. That's valid for everybody. It's going to hit everybody at some point in their life. Enjoy it. So for a quick recap, go ahead, make the exit and departure. But do so freely, releasing everything that's been holding you back. The promise, what's waiting, wishes and dreams come true. And that leads to happy, joyous life. I'm Terry Yoder. Thank you for watching. If you need anything, you know how to reach me. TerryYoder.com. Thanks for watching.